What's up, Creepers? Hey, here's Chris, the Atari Creep. How is everyone doing today? Guys, I have another video planned for today, but this just popped up. This just popped up. And I want to speak upon it because we've talked about this before. Now, for anyone who's fairly new to my channel, I'm an enormous Terminator fan. Enormous. I mean, I even I keep Terminator everywhere I go. That's a, that was a gift from my buddy Ordo Necro over on the Instagrams, you know. If you've been around, I have a whole playlist on Terminator stuff. I built a one-to-one -one scale replica of the Terminator skull. I got an army of the Kenner T-800 figures. And if you have any of those, I could always use more. Let me know. Hit me up on social media and we'll work something out. But more importantly, this. We talked about this. I started following this guy, World of Wayne, here on YouTube. And what he does primarily is, over in the UK, it's really popular to do these subscription build kits. And we're starting to see them more relevant, prevalent here in the States. And they've been around. I mean, it's not like it's new to us. But the idea is little pieces of this model kit will come to you in small increments. Or over in the UK, even better, you could walk into your newsstand or whatever, and they'll have them there. Every week a new one will show up, and hopefully they'll have some supply of older ones if you want to get into it later on down the road after the fact. But long story short, I've been watching him over the past year or so, give or take, I don't know how long. Um, they're building this thing. It's a half-scale Terminator kit. He's, every week he comes up, and he's got a couple of pieces, and sometimes he'll get two in a week or whatever. But for the most part, that's the idea. Every week you get a little bit of a taste of it, you put it together, and you have to wait for the next month or the next week. And, and, and over time, over a long progression of time, you slowly see this thing come to life. Well, I just found out by accident, purely by accident, that we are finally going to get this here in the States. Now, this comes with a couple of unfortunate caveats, if you will. But that was one of my biggest gripes. We couldn't get these here in the United States. And I was so pissed about it. But you can now, if you want to spend $130 a month, uh, your first pack will come to you at $64.99, plus taxes and shipping and all that stuff. Um, but then from there on, for the next 11 months or so, it's uh, $130. Now, that's, I guess that's a great deal. It's a, a metal half scale. It's going to be about three feet tall. T-800 replica. I believe parts of it are remote control. It'll come with its own stand and base with lights and all kinds of good stuff. But you know me, I'm never fucking happy. I'm never happy. And what I'm not happy about is this right here. The one thing that charmed me on this whole thing was it's... It, I don't even know how to say it. The, the, the tiny little piece mill of putting it together slowly over... I think it was like 18 months it was going to be going out. And I don't know how many weeks that is. You do 18 times 4 or whatever it is. But over the time, you know, you get this one kit, you get this other kit, you get this. And also, it's on the wallet. It's a lot more convenient, obviously. You're only paying, say, for example, $12 a week. And if you can't afford that $12 for the first, the next couple of weeks, you just don't go get it. And then when you have the extra bucks, you go and get it and all that. I just like the charm of that. Just maybe not even necessarily just walking into a store because that's becoming a nightmare these days that we're going to be talking about here pretty soon in my next uh, current events video that everyone liked from the last time. So what they're doing is instead of doing it like that, because it's going to come to the States, I guess, I don't know, they have to put so many of those weekly things into one package and ship it out to you once a month. And, they, and I did, over here in the blue, on the right, you see, I did I did chat with them. And they are like, yeah, I mean, that's just how, it's only for the UK people that have that fun Thing. We have to give you guys big lump sums because fuck the United States or whatever. Uh, but we will pass that on to our team. <clears throat> you know what that means. That means thanks for reaching out, but we don't care what you get to say. So the pre-sales, I don't know how long the pre-sales have been going on, but ironically it's going to ship this month at some point. Uh, again, your first one will be at a 50% discount. But then from there on, it's $129 a fucking month. Now, I thought about it. I thought about it, but... Realistically, I can't commit to $130 a month. Um, it's just not going to happen. I'll leave the link to this down below so you can read all this in, in you know, in, in entirety. 
But I guess that's really just one of $9 shipping. It's only going to be $10 shipping. This thing's partly metal. $129 is going to get you how many pieces? I don't know. I don't know. But, okay. So the whole point of my, my gripe video is, is I think we're getting fucked. <laughs> I think we're getting fucked out of this thing. And I'm actually quite upset about it. It's some petty bullshit. I know it is. But regardless, I was really excited when I first saw this. And then when I found out that we couldn't get it here in the States, now I see it's in the States. It's kind of like a tease. It's kind of like this is the biggest blue balls that you could ever give to the creep. Maybe if I was just a little bit less crippled, I could work a little bit more. I don't know. Don't be a douchebag. Make more fucking money. <sighs> Sometimes it's not that simple, but I, I don't know. I don't even know where I'm going with this. I just I just know I, I really like the charm of being able to get the pieces of it weekly, maybe skip a week here and there if I need to, and build it over the course of like a year and a half, two years, versus an 11-month subscription with these huge boxes showing up on it. I don't know. Am I just, is this needless? That's probably what I'm going to call it, needless rants. But either way, guys, let me know what you think down in the comments below. This thing is sexy. Dude, it's over three feet tall. It's going to have lights and movable parts and a really sexy stand that I don't have anywhere to put anyway. But that's not the point. It's needless stuff that I really want to have in my life. And the way they're distributing it, I can't have it. So, guys, go ahead and leave your feedback. Thumbs up, thumbs down, all feedback to the creep is positive. Guys, I haven't officially announced it yet, but I have already started my walk to end Alzheimer's 2020 campaign. I've registered as of yesterday or the day before. Day one, I got $150 in donations. We're going to have a ton of giveaways. A ton of giveaways. Random ones, so you need to be following, you need to be watching, you need to keep your fucking ear to the ground, because I'm not going to announce it, it could be in the middle of a random video, and I'm not doing that per se for views, because I don't take this shit too seriously, but I am like that, I am random, I will all of a sudden be like, oh, you know what guys, tell you what, the next 10 people who donate, I'll put you in a run in to win this Coca-Cola, you know, there's something I might be painting here pretty soon that I'm pretty damn sure I don't need. So that's probably going to be given away in a similar fashion. So guys, I'm serious. If you just want to donate, the link is down below. If you want to pass that link along, that will do equally as much benefit. Is that English? I doubt that was English. As sending a donation my way, getting the word, the awareness out there is the most important part. Of course, getting the money to the Alzheimer's Association is also important so they can work towards Finding that first survivor of Alzheimer's. I got tons of stuff planned. Weekly, non-regulated giveaways. Yeah, guys, it's going to be a big year for the creep in the Alzheimer's Association. And day one proved that we are well on our way to doing that. And if you're the type of guy who doesn't like to donate unless you're getting something out of it, well, fuck, I'm going to have a bunch of stuff to give you anyway, so... Uh, yeah, so if I did a whole thumbs up, thumbs down, all that stuff, I'm pretty sure I did. So, guys, thank you always so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Until next time, take care. Creep it real. Let me know if you find out anything more about these things coming weekly or something like that. That would be fantastic if our hobby shops could get this. Guys, take care. Bye-bye.